genes, the code of life. Everything about life on our planet is closely related to it. For thousands of years, human beings have been searching for the ultimate secret of life. So genes are what we call little bits of DNA in our body. These little bits of DNA that we are now calling genes are very important for the functioning of the body. Since 350 BC, starting from Aristotle's conjecture to the completion of the Human Genome Project, the development of modern biogenetics has given us a glimpse of life's full view and a new understanding of genes' actual roles. Nothing happens inside the body without the cooperation of our genes. Genes control who we are, what we are, and how we are. That type of research can give us insight into what happens at the molecular level and also gives us help on looking at the sources of, of aging. Now that we've been able to solve some practical problems with the new technologies, so let us reintroduce you to gene technology with modern sciences. We have a chance to unravel the old mystery and discover the truth about skin aging. We will explore the secrets of genes to learn how they affect human life. Going through aging and restoration, explore the new possibility of genetic skin care. Unlock your potential and discover the best you. Hundreds of millions of years of evolution has bred this colorful world. On this blue planet, scientists are striving to understand life. From the Human Genome Project, we are now beginning to understand that all of us, together as a human species, we share very many similarities in our genes. In fact, there's less than 1% difference between people in terms of their genetic makeup. Understanding that genetic differences are very similar between individuals is essential for exploring the mysteries of aging. Now, through observations of individual coming from two different regions, Guizhou Plateau and the prosperous urban area, scientists have located the answer of some of the questions. Guiyang, located in Eastern Asia, Guizhou Plateau, has an average altitude of about 1,000 meters. Hu Yiting is currently an 11th grader in higher vocational college. Like many other local children in the valley, long time of life of Plateau has brought great difficulties to her skin care. On the other side, Shanghai, located on the west coast of the Pacific Ocean, is 1,800 kilometers away from Guizhou. The fast-paced urban life of this international metropolis is putting much pressure on Lin Ling, as she has just started her career. Everybody has unique skin, and everybody is different, and a lot of different factors can go into the way your skin feels and the way that your skin looks. Through observation, it is easy for us to find that even coming from the same race and has almost the same genetic condition, individual skin condition can be very different. Scientists have found the answer to this question. Gene expression is really a term that we use when a gene 
becomes active. And the primary function of a gene is to produce a protein. And this protein then helps a particular tissue in the body to behave normally and to remain healthy. So gene expression is really a way to describe when a gene is being switched on. It's almost like a light switch. You can turn on the light with the switch or you can switch it off. Understanding the nature of things is the cornerstone of human progress. In Guizhou, Hu Yiting began to relearn the ancient dyeing techniques. Through the exploration and study of the patterns and techniques, even plain cloth can be dyed into bright colors. Just as science is continuing to explore the role of gene expression is crucial to solve the problem of aging. 基因表达是我们时时刻刻在改变的，同时呢，我们是可以通过一些手段去进行干预的. For example, we have discovered that gene expression gets slower and slower as you get older. So, if we can restore the normal gene expression of age-related genes, then we believe that uh, such products can help a person to slow down the aging process. In the face of complex problems. Science often uses the simplest way to find the answer, and it also gives us hope to achieve the seemingly impossible goal, that is locating the factors of individual aging. Among the 23,000 genes in the human genome, we have discovered that several thousand of those genes are very important in controlling aging of the body. As a major organ of human body, skin aging is also affected by gene expression. Now science is also exploiting the unlimited potential of this technology. So can we improve the aging process of skin? <音>我们因为已经找到了跟衰老相关的基因表达找到了它我们就有机会通过一些手段去对这些基因表达去进行干预作为一名皮肤科医生吧我们可能并不仅仅是给病人解决一些疾病的痛苦那我们现在更多的
just like learning techniques from observation. By adjusting gene expression, we can discover a path to safer and more effective skin rejuvenation. If there might exist another shortcut. By studying gene expression in skin cells, we learned that a biphasic modulated pulse microcurrent can actually increase important molecules in the skin. It activates, it energizes the skin. Over the last 20 years, there have been several improvements in microcurrent technology, beginning with galvanic microcurrent. The next change was using a pulsed microcurrent biphasic. And the third type, invented, patent applied for, is biphasic modulated pulsed microcurrent. The modulation means that the pulses are always different. And what this does is it confuses the skin. Technological innovations come with better effects and results, but also put forward new challenge for the formula to match with it. A few of the unique uh, challenges we had when we were creating a formula with the Boost device was that it needed to have the right conductivity in order for the device to provide the right benefit for the skin. From microcurrent to pulse current, and then to variable pulsed microcurrent, just as in life, challenges would only be overcome by determination of moving forward and unremitting efforts. The continuous improvement of technology only dedicates to acquire better skin care effects. With the deepening of gene research, we will be able to create a vibrant new world to keep skin youthful. At present, we are constantly exploring effective means to adapt to individual needs. In the field of skin care these days, we've been able to have many breakthroughs. And I think one of the more important breakthroughs is having something that can be personalized to you. We have many tools that we can use to find out what people need for their particular skin. And the next stage of gene expression profiling technology is making genetic skin care possible. I think with this increased understanding of genetic uh, expression and so on, we can customize a product based on genetic expression and how that expression has changed in your life. When we are still thinking about the significance of the new wave of genetic skin care, the gene expression technology has already shown us new possibilities. This series of applications has changed their understanding of themselves and our lives up until now. Right now, because of the new gene technology, we are able to do something. The question is now, in what way can we do something? Well, being involved in science for the last 50 years, I have noticed that there's tremendous research being done all over the world in many laboratories and institutions. But the real challenge is moving that research into products that are beneficial to people. And so probably the most important thing is understanding your skin. Uh, what does your skin need? Once we get a better idea of these sources of aging, we can then formulate products that help with these different conditions. Fundamentally, I know and I recognize that I cannot help you getting older. But what I'm hoping our scientific research and objective is to say that you can be as healthy as possible and as you get older. Genes, like a code book of life. The study of it may never end. The more we know, the more we find out we don't. 
The knowledge of gene expression has led us to the door of keeping individuals healthy and youthful. But on the way to explore the ultimate mystery of life, there are still many unsolved mysteries waiting for us to find out. Human beings' pursuit of truth will never stop. Discovery will continue.